Hey everybody, this is Jason. Uh, you might have seen some of my little paintings or drawings on Facebook or Instagram recently. And had a lot of people asking me just like, what are these all about? What are these weird little paintings that you're doing? And so it's a form of uh, pareidolia or pareidolic images. It's kind of like when you look at a cloud um, or see Jesus and toast or something like that. It's kind of that same idea. So. Here's an example of one I just recently did. It's a, a little frog man coming out of a hole. He's wearing his terry cloth robe and a little hairy chest eating a fly. Anyways, uh, how, how we do this is I just randomly uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. I'll do 13 dots because I'm a Jason and uh, 13 is my lucky number for Friday the 13th, right? So what I have here now is just a uh, random series of dots. I'm going to uh, connect those just any which way. And then what I do is I just uh, look at that, spin it around until I, uh, I see I see lots of things like this could be a little a fish here with a weird hat. Here's his tail. Um, yeah, I don't know. Maybe you have some ideas. Put those in the comments here. Tell me what you see. But um, yeah, we'll just go with the weird, the weird uh, fish with a hat. How about that? So I give myself a little bit of free reign here, where the lines are just kind of an inspiration or starting point. I'm not; they're not set in stone. If I see something I want to erase, like maybe I don't want this tail here. I give myself permission to erase that and things like that. So I'm just going to go ahead and start kind of working on this, speed it up a little bit so you can kind of see the process. And then uh, later on, I'll show you how I transfer it to watercolor and then uh, what the finished product looks like. Uh, I've changed my mind instead of a hat. I think it would be kind of funny to have the old kid in play uh, Afro High high afro thing that he had there So let's do a bunch of little curls here So just giving myself the few final details here. So as you can see, added some scales, got the nice uh, high top fro there, some seaweed, little bubbles, things like that. I'll add more details whenever I paint it in, but that uh, that's pretty much it for this first round. Uh, check back in and I'll uh, show you how I transfer it to watercolor paper and then how we get it painted up.